The Nokia 8.1 isn't a successor to the Nokia 8 flagship. The front and rear of the phone is made of glass and there's an aluminium frame holding the whole thing together. Both the front and back have 2.5D Gorilla Glass protection. Nokia 8.1 features a 6.18 inch display with a full HD plus resolution. This device has 3500 mAh battery packed inside. Concerning cameras, it's a dual sensor shooter with the main one being a 12 megapixel 1.8 sensor and the second sensor is 13 megapixel 1. In terms of video, you can record 720p full HD and USD 4K video. On the front, the selfie camera has a 12 megapixel sensor. Inside there is a Qualcomm Snapdragon 710 chipset with 4GB of RAM. This phone has 64GB of inbuilt storage but the handset comes with support for 400GB of external storage. Vivo S1 Pro smartphone was launched in 3rd May 2019. The phone comes with a 6.39 inch touchscreen display with an aspect ratio of 19.5 by 9. It is powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon 675 and comes with 8GB of RAM. As far as the cameras are concerned, the Vivo S1 Pro on the rear packs a 48MP primary camera with an 1.7 aperture. It sports a 32MP camera on the front for selfies with an 2.0 aperture. It was launched in love blue and coral red colors. Huawei Nova 5 smartphone was launched in June 2019. The phone comes with a 6.39 inch OLED touchscreen display with an aspect ratio of 19.5 by 9. It is powered by an octa core high silicon Kirin 810 processor. It comes with 8 GB of RAM. As far as the cameras are concerned, the Huawei Nova 5 on the rear packs quad camera setup consisting of a 48 megapixel main shooter and a 16 megapixel ultra wide lens and 2 megapixel dedicated macro lens along with a 2 megapixel depth sensor. There is a 32 megapixel camera on the front for selfies. This device is based on EMUI 9.1 on top of Android 9.0 Pi and packs 128GB of inbuilt storage that can be expanded via microSD card up to 256GB. It is powered by a 3500mAh battery with 40W fast battery charging support. It was launched in black, purple and green colors. The Redmi K20 Pro comes with a 6.39 inch Full HD Plus AMOLED screen of 2340x1080p resolution. It has an aspect ratio of 19.5x9 and 91% screen to body ratio. The display also houses an in screen fingerprint sensor. Powered by Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 processor with Adreno 640 GPU, the Redmi K20 Pro also comes with Game Turbo 2.0 which is also said to optimize the handset for better gaming experience. On the imaging front, the Redmi K20 Pro has a triple rear camera setup that includes a 48MP Sony IMX586 camera with a 1.75 aperture, an 8MP telephoto sensor with 2.4 aperture and a 13MP wide-angle sensor with 2.5 aperture. For selfie lovers, there is a 20MP sensor housed in a pop-up setup with a wide-angle mode. The front camera is claimed to pop out in 0.8 seconds. Overall, it's not a bad phone at all. The A70 is good enough to justify its mid-range price tag and soon you will know why. The Galaxy A70 is actually similar to the Galaxy A50 and follows the same 3D glastic design language where the glastic stands for glass-like plastic. With a 6.7-inch Infinity UV screen on the front, the phone is not the most compact option available in the market but it is still surprisingly manageable. The polycarbonate body with all the curves in the right places makes the phone feel sleek and relatively light in the hands. On the rear, the Galaxy S70 stacks a 32MP with 1.7 aperture primary sensor, 8MP wide-angle shooter and a 5MP depth sensor. As for the selfies, the Galaxy S70 uses the same 32MP sensor on the front as well. There's scene optimizer, live focus portrait mode, flow detection and many more options on the phone. Samsung has included 240fps slow-mos at 1080p, which should be fun to play around. The Qualcomm Snapdragon 675 SoC is currently placed into Galaxy A70. Samsung has paired 2GHz octa-core chipset with 6GB of RAM and 128GB of storage. There is a dedicated microSD card slot that can hold additional 512GB storage. It can handle demanding games, offers great battery life, has super fast charging and the full version of Samsung Pay that lets you go card free.